A close call with an alligator sent crews searching a part of the Savannah River in Jackson. NBC 26 reporter Navita Fergani tells us how man says he saved his dog's life. Toby Evans and his dog cats come to the Savannah River several times a week. Evans enjoys swimming there and he says it's not unusual to see alligators. But he says he was taken off guard when an alligator attacked his dog. Then I seen him rolling like, like, like he don't roll. So I dove in and when I dove over there, I grabbed that alligator. And I started wolfing on for him. And, uh, wolfing on my dog, I whooped on my alligators, and everybody broke loose. The dog That's seems it. fine, and Evans oh, only has a few scratches. He says he has no hard feelings for the gator. I don't blame the gator because the gators are doing, you know, they're gators. That's what they do. There are alligators all along the Savannah River, and experts say the best way to keep your pets safe is to keep them out of the water. But if your pet does get attacked, use your best judgment. If they feel like they can do something to get the alligator away from their pet, then you know, that, that's a decision that they're going to have to make. Uh, they also need to realize that alligators are pretty aggressive once they start into that, and maybe the best thing to do is just stay away from it. Officers are on the lookout for the alligator. In Jackson, Vita Fragani, NBC 26 News. The Department of Natural Resources says when it finds the alligator, it will be moved to another area.